Hey there everybody, this is Silent Mist and welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun. In the last part, we got to the switch and you're all dying to know what it does, aren't you? Because we obviously didn't do this exact same thing like 10 seconds or a couple minutes or rather in the last part. 10 minutes ago for me. But yes, look, we got the sand. And now we can get to that door down there and possibly complete this place. I don't know. Oh, looky there. That looks awfully suspicious. Uh, reveal. Oh, looks like we can't actually do anything. Too bad. <laughs> it looked awfully suspicious while we was, while we were still there. Um, let's just kill this thing. Maybe maybe we'll get like unleashes. No, nope. Isaac, you didn't get a Titan Blade. And oh my, it's been a little while since we've healed. I should really like take it into. Uh, I, I honestly think that it would be uh, beneficial to do such a thing right now. So let's just use some healy healy things. Um, oh, okay, good. Maxed out on health. Uh, oh gosh. <laughs> could we do that in the first place? Well, I guess we could have, but we can't actually run against the current that much. Ah! Wait. What? We, we already... What? This is where we came in from, right? Oh! Durr! We can go here now. <laughs> I was just like, wait, we've already been here. What's this madness? Oh my. Manticore King, you're going to die because you're going to get the honor of dying on screen because right now I'm still commentating and that means that you're obviously going to need to stay in action for me to kill you. So as you see, you're obviously dead and oh look, a synergy stone. Let's just heal up completely with Mia's wish. Well, and now we can just get our synergy stone and I believe we're going to want to well, save here because I have a feeling that something important is going to be happening momentarily. So down the hall we go and uh, <laughs> oh, oh, we're stuck. Oh God, oh God. I, I, ah, oh, oh, amazing music. Ah, oh, now I need to shut up. Oh, well, even more amazing music, I should say. At long last, oh, what kind of a voice did she add? I think she had like some crazy, uh, at long last, the time has come to- I've given every person like some strange either hillbilly or Texan accent. That's because I don't know how to do anything else. At long last, the time has come to light Venus Lighthouse's beacon. With the second beacon lit, only two will remain. No, lighting Jupiter is virtually the same as lighting Mars. That is true, Jupiter is really all that remains. That's right, your dreams are within your grasp now. Wait, he's talking. That That is something that you won't be seeing too much later. Why are you still here, Felix? I thought I ordered you ahead to the ship. Oh, I remember I gave her like some strange Romanian accent if I, believe, if I remembered. Then why did you come back? Oh, it's gonna be difficult to voice her, I already know it. <laughs> because I have a different promise to keep. A promise, you say? Oh no, that definitely wasn't it. <laughs> I don't know. You must mean Shiva. But that is your new voice, uh, Minardi, that is your new voice. Yes, yeah, Shiba, why haven't you released her yet? You promised to free her once you got into the Venus Lighthouse. And that's what brought you, brought you back here. You promised not to involve anyone who wasn't related to this matter. Shiba's, Shiba's special. Oh, I can't keep, uh, no one gets their own voice. They just get like one of many, of course. Because Shiba's a special adept. You guys learned something from the first two lighthouses. And what would that be? In order to enter each lighthouse, you needed an adept of, each of that clan. <laughs> right now, we have fire, earth, and water adepts, but no wind adept. That does seem to be the case. Do we need Shiva to get into the Jupiter lighthouse? I'm sorry, Felix, but we cannot enter even, but we cannot enter. We cannot even enter without a wind adept. That being the case, I guess I understand why you can't set Shiba free. It seems that you, too, have learned something. Oh, wait, wrong, wrong person. If that is all, then you should go, Felix. No, I cannot leave Shiba behind. I'm taking Shiba to the ship. What are you talking about, Felix? We don't even know what will happen if you light this beacon. I won't leave Shiba here to find out. We told you to, we'd protect Shiba, don't you trust us? That's not what I'm saying. It's just best to be safe. Don't tell us what's best, to Felix. You're not taking Shiva. Why not? What? You don't trust me? How can we? After you just demanded that we freed Shiva. 
we had trusted you a moment ago, Shiva would be free now. <laughs> she has such a ridiculous voice. I, I, I no. Come with me, Shiva. I shall protect you. Oh, oh, rejection. Don't. Oh. Are you ready to do this, even if, it, even though it means fighting us? I believe he is. He would not have defied us if he lacked the will to fight. It me, if it means protecting Shiva from her, from harm, then I must. Oh, what's this? Do you have some, uh, something you'd like to tell us? I don't know. You seem to, uh, yeah, you have seen what we can do. You know you can't stop us. How can you protect Shiva when you can't even protect yourself? This rebellious attitude is, act, is uh, exactly why we never let you fight. Haven't you been given enough reason to fear us in these travels? You're no fighter, Felix. How can you hope to stand against us? You've questioned us for the last time. Let's see what you can do. Oh, oh, it looks like, it looks like they're having a fall, <laughs> it looks like they're having a falling out over Shiba. There's something more to it though. It seems that Zartaros and Minardi no longer trust Felix. It looks just like, it looks like the perfect opportunity has just fallen into our laps. Now's our only chance to prevent them from lighting the beacon, sure. There's not a moment to spare, let's move. And so we don't have to deal with like five minutes of uh, of that, let's let's do this, and we're actually going to want to uh, do a rather risky move. Uh, I don't know if this is going to be the best of ideas, but let's try it out. Summoning, summon rushing, rather. Oh, oh, there you are, there you are. You're gonna die, ah! Isaac, no, you just ruined our plans, damn it! So you've come to stop us. Look at what your defiance has brought us, Felix. I don't need you or anyone to rescue me, Isaac. I was just about to settle things with Satoru Simnardi. You can watch. Then we'll show you the true power of this beacon's lighthouse. But Shiba has nothing to do with this, so set Shiba free. Silence, you best tread lightly, Felix, so you, both you and Shiba will suffer. If anything happens well to, Sh to Shiba, we'll have found Farron. We won't permit you to lay a hand on Shiba or Felix. Oh, so you're worried about Shiba too? Don't worry, we won't hurt Shiba if you meet our conditions. What are you doing, Satoros? Leave this to me. Shiba, do you remember the, ro the rod connected to Hesperia? The rod of Hesperia? Or, whoa, whoa that, that is not the voice I will be giving you. The rod required to reach the Jupiter Lighthouse. Y yes Those who pursue us bear a rod. Is this the one? Shiba, stay where you are. You can do it from there. Oh, oh, what's this? How about it, Shiba? Well, Shiba? Perhaps. Perhaps. Perhaps what? <laughs> oh, this is gonna absolutely destroy my voice. Don't yell at her. We're not yelling, we just want a straight answer. Yep, it is. So, Shiba? Their minds are veiled, but I cannot see clearly, but I think it's the one. It's a waste to make her try again. Oh, wrong voice. So what should we do? Do you know the terms we will require before we agree not to harm Shiba? Yep. You're smarter than I thought if you've already figured out. If you give us the shaman's rob, Shiba will not be harmed. Agreed? Ah, nope. <laughs> I actually don't care. If you want, if he wants the shaman rod, he wants the shaman. Ah, he wants the shaman's rod. If it will save Shiba, I'll give it up. What? But Hammett gave that to you, Ivan. Don't you care what happens to Shiba? No, not particularly. Then you will give us the rod. Well done, Satros. We finally have the shaman's rod. Go get it, Felix. Why me? To ensure your loyalty to us. Go on, Felix. Isaac handed over the, oh wait, that, that, <laughs> don't need to read that. What should I do with the rod? Keep it safe. Oh, that, that's Minardi's. Where do you think you're going, Shiba? We gave you the rod, now really Shiba. Whatever do you mean? You said you'd free Shiba if we gave you the rod. Those were your terms. We gave you the rod so you'd release Shiba. You seem to have misunderstood. We said, I said we wouldn't harm Shiba, but I never said we'd let her go. Oh, he does have a point. A deal is a deal. You're altering the bargain. Oh gosh. Ha, ha. 
We can't help it that you misinterpreted Satros's terms. Besides, if we were to release Shiba, she'd be in quite a fix. What do you mean? Or what do you mean? Shiba can't get to that lava area alone. What do you mean? We're going to take Shiba. Oh no. That's right, you won't be going back. This is it for you. Excuse me? Enough, you're the ones who aren't going anywhere. Bring it on, whelp. You won't live long enough to regret your stupidity. Prepare to experience firsthand the horror of a master fire adept. Oh, okay, it's finally time. Time for this battle. Oh, this song, it's pretty amazing, but yes, it's finally time for us to get on with this battle. So let's just quickly do some massive summon rushing. Um, hopefully we'll live a couple of turns so my, uh, my, my idea of summon rushing won't go, oh gosh, that could hurt. Uh, won't go to waste. Oh, and protect, lame, whatever. Take, take, Thor! So yes, finally we're facing down with our dastardly enemy, Sato Seminardi. Hopefully we'll be able to end them quickly and, well, you know, do all the usual. I should do a decent chunk of damage, at least in the beginning. Um, afterwards, we're just going to have to focus on staying alive. My main priority actually should be to get rid of Minority because she has a oh excuse me she has a move that is capable of one hit killing us so it would be in best interest to quickly remove her from the equation so from now on every attack that I will be uh, that I will be using will be in one way or another focused on bringing down Minority uh, whether that be like just focusing the the main brunt of the attack on her or something else actually. Uh, Garrett, that's a completely useless thing to do. You can just summon a, uh, it isn't even, there isn't even much of a point in summoning Kieran, but you two can just summon your summony summons. Oh god, oh god, and that's why we take care of, that's why we take care of Minority first. Um, hopefully we can end her rather quickly. She shouldn't have too much health, I think. Um, although I believe Mia will be quite helpful in this fight with, uh, all of her water stuff because you know water is super effective on fire but we're already kind of doing bad <laughs> in this battle um one man down i i think that we can uh we can recover from this uh however whoa why do we have shine plasma and hail prism um hail prism would actually be a better idea so we'll use that and then um oh do you have anything that can be used to heal yourself uh good you do Oh god, you're dead. Oh god, Mia. Okay, I, for a second. Oh, that's not very nice. Making me all delusionally. But now I really should focus. Oh, look, Minardi's dead. Okay, main problem taken care of. Now we can just uh, focus on ending the life of M Satoros. Um, shouldn't be too difficult. Wow, that that was actually much easier than I thought it would be for uh, c considering the circumstances and considering how helplessly weak I am right now but uh, these guys aren't much of a problem I mean we, we've fought enemies that have been worse than this you we ha we fought that one lizard who brought us down to one man oh look we're, we're coming back to life um still no actually let's see if we can get a uh, a nice little summon off while we just do all this nope or not summon uh that that nice little Titan thing oh my oh look nothing nothing hail prism though that that That'll hurt a little bit, right? Right? Um, what can we do? What do, what do we have for Jin now? Uh, we don't have what I think we do, do we? No, we do not. So, no, not even gonna bother to use these guys anymore. Um, Ragnarok and Hill Prism. I think this might finish him off. Could be wrong, though, but regardless. Ah, you can protect your mother. It won't do anything against my attacks. Oh, look, you're dead. Hey, that was a pretty easy last boss fight, wasn't it? Ah, uh, Minardi's party goes down. You got 6,000 experience points. Yay! And we're at level 28. Fantastic. Doll. Oh. We did it. We beat him. All right, Chiba, let's go. Oh. Felix, what are you doing? I cannot give up Shiba. What? We just saved you. I never asked us asked you to help us. Felix, you're not one of them. You're free to go now. So why are you doing this? The four beacons must still be lit. You're going to light the beacons? That's ridiculous. I felt you'd say that, but I'm going to do it anyways. So wait, if he means to light the beacon, then he's our enemy, right? 
Hmm, I don't know. Uh, well, we've been fighting Satros and Minority this entire time because they've been trying to light the beacons. I mean, I guess they kidnapped our friends and family, but I don't know. I'm just gonna assume that, th that he is. Do what you will, Isaac, but if you try to stop me, I'll fight you. Oh, I hope you don't think you finished us off. Oh, oh, you know, you could just stop him right now. No, no biggie, plop. <laughs> you may not be finished, but you can barely stand. Right now, yes, but we will be back on our feet as soon as we, this.